And we're back, aren't we, Lachlan? We're uh, just about to start event 14. Boys under 15, 1500 metre walk. And it's a final. Nikolaj Dokovic from Entone, Alex Hayes, Nicola Mandic, Lachlan Benbo, Riley Turnbull, Bede Collis, Jerome Tucker and Jaden Day. And Bede Collis looks like he's uh, got out there to a very strong start right now. It's a beautiful day for any kind of activity right now, isn't it, Lachlan? It is. It's a bit blustery up here, uh, outside, but nothing too bad. Nothing for what you normally get at Lakeside Stadium, anyway. Uh, but a great morning. I wouldn't be running. Wouldn't want to be running too much later, uh, with the weather. It's due to heat up quite a bit. However, now it's perfect. Certainly is. So it looks like. Uh, Bede's just been overtaken now by Nicola Mandic from Berwick. So looking at the times actually on the sheet, Nicola's come in with the fastest seed time. So on paper at least, he's the favourite. Yeah, and then we've got a... Nicolaj as well from Mento. Only just behind him with a couple of more seconds. Seated there. Now, just for our viewers' sake, you can see that we've got the main camera uh, on the start, and then we've got another camera who's actually trying to capture someone from the back of the pack. So we're trying to bring as much of this as possible, but as you can see, they're very well spread out. these walks are going on here Raf will introduce the competitors in the event 15 the boys under 13 80 meter hurdles so this event's scheduled for about five minutes but it looks like they're going to jump on the line here so we will introduce it in lane three we've got Ricky Reed from Geelong in lane four we have Lachlan Curtis from Nunawading in lane five we have Angus Grant from Campbellwell Malvern in lane six, we have Connor Matsell from Preston Reservoir. In lane seven, we have Archie no Noax from Coburg. In lane eight, we have Ilya Simonovsky from Diamond Valley. In lane nine, we have Aiden Shearer from Caulfield. So based on this, Lachlan, we've got um, Aiden Shearer who's um, come in at a 12.78. So on paper, he's the fastest seed time, that's for sure. Who's your pick for this one, Lachlan? Oh, well, looking at the seed times, Aiden Shearer is going to be my pick. He is on the outside <laughs> lane, so he's not going to be able to, if he, especially if he gets out to a good start here, he's not going to see much of his competitors. Um, however, they would be used to, used to that there. So as they are here on the start line, so we are running right on time. So it does look like... They're probably not going to start the race until at least a little bit closer to that 9.55. Mark, you will notice on the screen as well that the clock uh, the clock will only time the hurdles as we've got two track events running at the moment. Oh, um, right. The clock will just time the hurdles. When we go back to one event, we'll be able to capture all time for all events. 
And just a few shout-outs coming out on the screen. As you can see, we got a shout-out from Chris Locke, who's um, letting us know that good luck to all the Cranbourne athletes. So thanks, Chris, for that good luck. And if you too want to give a shout out to any of the athletes in your centre, then just jump on board our Facebook channel and hit the comment. And if we see it, we'll put it across the screen. So thanks for that. Good luck there, Chris. We've got another one from Jacqueline who's saying, Go Caulfield. It's good to see the centres getting behind each other. So we're just going to let you enjoy the ambulance in a second and just enjoy the ambient noise and we'll be back commentating in about four minutes. As we get ready to go here, in the first heat of the boys under 13, 80 metre hurdles, we'll keep an eye out on lane 9, Aidan Shearer from Caulfield. Who's going in with the quickest seeds on. Looks like we're about ready to start. underway here and as suspected Aiden from Caulfield there is he's off to a great run in lane lane nine there. You see him striding away right away from the rest of the pack all the way through and a great run there. And we're not quite sure. 1254 unofficial time. We almost had a three-way for the second position there between the Nunna Wadding, Diamond Valley and a long athlete. So 12.54 unofficial time. A great run. Yeah, 12.78. Aiden had. 